They're in everything from mac and cheese to salad dressing to bubbly water. Beyond water, sugar, and salt, natural flavors are the most common ingredient in processed food. Zach from Lionel Lakes wanted to know what are natural flavors? Good question. Now the Brown explains where they come from and why they're added to so many foods. So you see it right there on this box of rice. <laughs> Natural flavor. Naturally flavored. Yep, right there, natural flavor. Oh boy, we got a theme going here. <laughs> How do they make this water taste like watermelon? Natural flavors. <laughs> Isn't ketchup already pretty flavorful? Yeah, but apparently not enough. Gary Rhinexis is a flavor scientist at the U of M. It might lack some of the intensity that people like. I mean, you're, they're trying to deliver something people like. Does it surprise you that it's in all of these foods? No, it doesn't. Not at all. What is natural flavor? Well, flavorings are odd in that category. They're the only additives defined by the government. Here's the full definition, and here's the gist. They have to come from something natural, fruit, vegetable, bark, bud, root, meat, but mostly. They're extracting natural materials from plants and doing minimal processing to it. It can be heated or distilled. For example, lemon flavor comes from the oil of the lemon peel, strawberry flavor. What they'll do is they'll harvest strawberries, they'll put them into alcohol water mixture. You gotta squish a lot of them though. <laughs> then you can sell it alcohol water for clear beverages. I think they're using a play on words to sell a product. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be natural. If people are out shopping, should they be concerned at all about natural flavors? I wouldn't. I'm not. The FDA doesn't test every single chemical used in food additives, but does require anything used in natural flavors be generally recognized as safe. Generally recognized as safe. <laughs> That's really encouraging. I've had my children mm -hmm. <laughs> my children's children, mm -hmm. <laughs> things that have artificial flavors in, and I'm, I'm extremely comfortable with it. And natural flavors. And natural, both of them. I mean, you can't get no more natural than a banana. Right. And I just turned 57. In St. Paul. So that's your secret. Yeah. The I, natural. Yeah, natural. <laughs> Heather Brown. If it's natural, it's natural. WCCO 4 News. Uh, you might be surprised to learn that natural flavors and artificial flavors are basically the same chemicals. Our bodies metabolize them in the same way. It's just that one is found in nature and the other made in the lab. If you have a good question for Heather, please email it by going to wcco.com links.